Do my teammates see me? They just launch torpedoes my way. What the hell? That's a full spread. Good thing I turned just in time. Those are two full spreads right there. Hi there, MC here for Steel Falcons Gaming and I'm back again with another World of Warships gameplay video. It is a Tuesday night and again I'm relaxing after work and here we are with another random battle and I'm using the tier 7 German, crew, uh, German battleship, the Gneiss now. Um, so it's uh, the two brothers map one of the maps that I least like in World of Warships and that mission again we're in we only have one objective each that we control so the game is simple get the enemy objective or kill all enemy ships whichever comes first and like the map this is also the mission that I most dislike in World of Warships but since this is a random battle I cannot really choose so I get on to the game okay. fired my first shot there and I get a hit Anyways, for this mission, the initial choice would be initial choices for the teams would be to either go left or go right. Do you stay together or do you split up? And then do you just stay home and defend? Or do you go aggressive and take the fight to the enemy team? And Given that number of choices, it's not really clear what my team is up to. So I guess some are staying home, some are going offensive, and some are not quite sure what to do with it. Which, is, which are pretty much the signs that we may lose this game, but let's not lose hope. Maybe the enemy team is doing the exact same thing too. Okay, enemy contact here, a destroyer 8 kilometers away, waiting for my guns to load. So unlike the Sharn, the Sharn horse, uh, the nice and all guns, the main guns, don't load this fast, but uh, they are higher caliber guns, so they hurt more if they hit. I kitted this nice now also to have a, an 8 kilometer range on its secondary guns. Just trying to keep within the theme of this battleship, which is really a brawling battleship more than anything else. So I would like to get close. But at the same time, I don't want to put myself as much forward and don't overextend as the enemy fleet might concentrate its fire on me. That's why I am turning around right now and luckily just in time. Or I could have eaten those enemy torpedoes and I would have been down by now. I to get rid of this pesky destroyer. They have a destroyer advantage over us but we do have more cruisers so in my team we have three destroyers, four cruisers and five battleships to begin with. Now only just four battleships because one battleship already sank to the bottom of the sea while the enemy fleet 
Okay, we just got our first scale cruiser. Anyways, um, to start with, the enemy fleet had four destroyers, just two cruisers, and they have a battleship advantage as well. They had six to begin with. Okay, come on, die. What else? We still have a destroyer here, but also close to death. Just one hit is all it will take to get him. Okay, he's down. Two more destroyers to get rid of. Let's put our attention on this cruiser because I hate getting my ship on fire. Oops. Oh no! No! One! Two! Uh, that was almost disaster for us. So my HP... Down to half, so I'm half down. Uh, with lots of enemy ships. So. I can survive this. Okay, secondary guns active. I'm facing this cruiser. I haven't checked what this cruiser is yet, but just a precaution. Might have torpedoes, so better kill him right now. Okay, he's turning sideways. He had torpedoes. Luckily, he's dead now. Applying the brakes to avoid hitting the islands, but I don't want to turn just yet because I see those. Okay, no more torpedoes. Next target. Let's take on this battleship. You're running away. Huh? Okay, there's a cyclone. Right now, but the range is still pretty much 27 kilometers, so whatever is at gun range, we should be able to spot. So, no, no not much effect in the game just yet. Okay, another kill. So, I took out another nice amount. Problem is, I have a Sharn Horse up front that is almost full health still. I don't want to be 6 kilometers from that ship. So I'm hoping my teams, destroyers, and cruisers will put in their work and put that thing on fire first. Just soften it up a bit before I come in for the kill. Okay, visibility is down to 8 kilometers because of the cyclone, so we can't find anything. I just launched my fighter plane, my spotter plane. Just wait a bit on the visibility. While that is going on, I think there are, yeah, there are enemy ships now almost halfway capturing, or more than halfway capturing our base. While we are just heading towards the enemy base. Good thing though is we have two friendly ships right there to at least give a challenge and prevent them from, from capturing our base and winning this whole thing. Should we have target? Hopefully I we can sink this quick. 
6.4 kilometers away. The magic number is 6 kilometers. So once I get into that range, I'm also in two torpedo range. I don't want to do that. Okay, here goes. Still alive. Okay, we have four enemy ships defending our base against four. Four of our ships defending our base, and then four enemy ships right there. We just sh sunk the Sharnhorst, and here's a Fuso that is almost full health. Heading towards it, as I have the torpedo advantage. Shooting torpedoes now. Going back to guns. Shooting guns. Turning. What? Do my friends see me? Do my teammates see me? They just launched torpedoes my way. What the hell? That's a full spread. Good thing I turned just in time. Those are two full spreads right there. What? And another one on my port side. I guess they didn't care. They just wanted the kill to get this over with. To hell with the nice and now. Oh, one more. What the hell? Ow! Good thing that didn't get me flooded as I didn't have a repair ready and I would have gone down and he would have been a pink ship after this thank my lucky stars anyways because of that there was no there was really no way out for that Fuso he was going down no matter what so with the cyclone still on, visibility still limited to 8 kilometers. We are 5 ships here capturing the enemy, enemy base. I guess this is a one game now for a team green once again. Just 10 seconds remaining on the capture clock shooting to get lucky and that's it team green wins the game once again and that's it another game of world of warships i hope you tune in once again click like and subscribe and continue watching my world of warships gameplay videos as well as the other videos on my channel this is MC, signing off, peace.